Hi you guys and welcome back. Today I'm going to do a, um, well it's not really small, I'm going to do a Dollar Tree haul. I'm going to try and do a full face of all Dollar Tree products. So uh, let's start with, let's start with the face. For foundation, they have this sassy and chic moisturizing foundation and I got this in the color Dark One because the other options were definitely a no. And then I got the BB cream in light one. So I'm gonna mix those two together, and if they are still too dark, then I just bought some um, of the cocoa butter that I can mix in with it, which will lighten it up and um, make it not quite as thick. So I'm gonna give these a try for my foundation. For my powder, I got this LA Colors in Nude. So I'm gonna use that to set everything. For my contour and um, like the highlight, like underneath my eyes and down the center of my nose, I got this LA Colors and I got this in Medium. So I'm gonna use this for the contour and then this for under my eyes and down the center of my face. For my bronzer, I got another pressed powder by LA Colors and this one is in the color Tan. And I think this will actually work pretty well. You can't test them obviously in store, but it has more of a bronze undertone, not a red undertone, which is gonna be good, hopefully. So that's what I'm gonna use for my bronzer. And then for the blush, there wasn't a lot to choose from. In fact, I think there were two. But I did pick up this Beauty Benefits Hollywood blush in the color Jam. So I'm gonna use that. And if it is too dark, which I have a feeling that it might be, um, I'll probably mix a little bit of baby powder in with that to lighten that up as well. And when I saw this packaging, it reminded me so much of Benefit Cosmetics. Okay, we're gonna move right on to the eyes. So I didn't find a primer, but I'm just gonna use the foundation as my primer that I picked up. And I got this 12 color eyeshadow from LA Colors. These are, I believe, all matte, I'm hoping. Um, and this is, and the, the palette is called Traditional. Well, let me try and make that. There we go. Ugh, my ring light is showing so bad. There we go. So I'm gonna use this for my transition colors and maybe to deepen the look up a little bit. Um, I did get four different of these creamy shimmery eyeshadow pencils by LA Colors. Two of them are the Mermaid Shimmer. One is in Surfside and one is in Splash. So this one has teal and purple. And then this one has like purple and a bluish color. So I, I don't know if I will use these for sure or not because I did pick up two more of the mermaid shimmers, but these are in Seashell and Sandcastle. And I think that I will probably use these um, for my inner corner highlight, for my brow bone, on my lid, and there we go. I may even use this one for my actual cheekbone highlight. We'll see. For a topper to that, I got this color, uh, it's called Brass by Wet n Wild. Now I know from previous experience that this glitter is just an overlay, but that's okay because I only need it for one use, so it should be fine. I picked up this automatic eyeliner by LA Colors it's in the color black brown, which was all they had. So I'm gonna use that for my tight line. Another Beauty Benefits, this is the Lengthening Mascara, Define and Lengthening in Black. Again, look at how much that looks like Benefit Cosmetics packaging. I love it. So I'm gonna use this for my mascara. And then I picked up these LA Color Dermatolash for my eyelashes. I'm definitely gonna have to do some work to these. But when I use them, I will show you how to take, because if you see, they're super shiny, which makes them very, very unrealistic. But I will show you when I go to use these, what I do with a, throwaway spoolie to kind of make them look a little bit more natural. And then finally for my lips, I got two different colors from Color Mates. 
Uh, they both came with lip liners as well as the lipstick. One is in Ginger Spice and one is in Dark Pink Frost. And I'm probably going to use the Ginger Spice, which is on this side. But we will see. So that is everything that I got for my full face of Dollar Tree uh, makeup. But I did go ahead and pick up just a few other things that I want to show you. We are going away this weekend for our anniversary. So I got three of the watermelon and mint from, um, is it Bellagio? I'm not sure how you, Bolero? I think, I don't know how you pronounce it. But I got three of these uh, bath fizzers because where we're staying actually has a jacuzzi in our room. I also got one in peony. I think that's how you say it, peony and pear. I did grab some of the peony and pear makeup um, removers to use when I'm doing my makeup. And then I just picked up one bag of each of the bath bombs, the watermelon and mint, and the peony and pear. Now I have used this one before and they smell so good and they really do um, make the water feel good. Like they give a nice fizz, they're pretty hydrating. I didn't feel like super gross when I got out of the bath. So these are actually pretty good. I'm looking forward to them. Now I haven't smelled this peony yet. I'm probably, I know I'm saying that wrong. You guys correct me in the um, comments, but um, this peony and pear um, I haven't smelled that yet, but I'm hopeful because I did smell it in the makeup wipes, and it smelled really good. So, anyway, that is everything. I will be doing this in just a couple of days. Until next time, you guys, remember there are no such thing as disabilities, only different abilities. I love you all. Make sure that you subscribe and hit the bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. You guys have a great weekend. I love you, and God bless.